All right, bruh. So, I got the dewy on today, and we finna throw on a hoodie for y'all. I just got off from work, and I'm back for another video. And today, bro, I was thinking at work, bro, I'm like, bro, I gotta make a video to let these niggas know why you suck at life, bro. Why you, you right there looking at the video, bro, why you suck at life. Why you suck at life, why you suck at whatever you're trying to do, why there's no motion. There's no motion in the ocean, there's nothing, okay? So, number one, bro, this about to go all up the top of my head, bro. Everything's coming straight off the dome, bro. I have nothing written down, bro. I can talk about this shit all day, okay? Number one, you care too much about what everybody think, bro. Stop caring about what everybody think. These niggas is not paying your bills. They not sucking your dick, and they not putting no money in your pocket, bro. If niggas is not doing none of that shit, bro, who cares? Nobody cares, bro. Don't nobody care, bro. Focus on you. Focus on what you're doing. Focus on getting to the money. Money, bro. Focus on getting to the money, bro. I don't know how many times I got to say that shit to y'all, bro. Whatever you're trying to do in life, bro. I said this one time in my video before, I'm going to say it again, bro. If you don't believe in yourself, bro, nobody else is going to believe in you, bro. How do you expect people to believe in you if you don't believe in yourself? Like me, I make music. I do YouTube, as y'all can see, because y'all watching the video right now. If I don't believe in myself, how is somebody supposed to believe the words coming out of my mouth? I got an EP dropping February 10th. Tune into that joint. It's finna be lit. But nah, I got a, I got an EP dropping. I believe in myself. I got niggas DMing me, commenting on my SoundCloud. Bro, you're hard, you're fired. They believe in me. But even when they didn't believe in me, even when there was nobody commenting, bro, I still believed in myself, bro. I have endless songs on the back burner that's trash. I got endless trash ass songs. But I still believed in myself and I still kept pushing. You gotta make them believe. You gotta stay consistent, bro. You posting on Instagram, bro, stay consistent. Stay consistent on Instagram, TikTok, Rumble, Twitter, all that shit, bro. Stay consistent, bro. You have to stay consistent. Without consistency, there's no motion, bro. You have to promote. Why do you think it's called promotion? Promotion. Because you have to pre-mote. No, I'm lying. Because <laughs> you have to have pre-motion. You have to pre- You have to pre-judge was you have to prejudge your success, bro. That's why it's called promotion. Promote yourself. That's what you gotta do, bro. You gotta keep posting, bro. Because niggas will sit and watch and watch and watch and watch and watch and watch and watch. They won't like, they won't comment, they won't do anything. They'll just watch you all the time. Females will watch and watch and watch and watch and watch. They won't like, they won't comment. But then when you blow, <laughs> everybody want to everybody wanna comment to you. Everybody want to talk to you. Everybody want to DM you. I'm dead ass. So it's like, be consistent, bro. Because when you're consistent, the niggas that's watching, they going to click the link. They going to click the link. They going to watch the video. They going to watch it. They feeding you views, analytics, all that shit, bro. Stay consistent. You get get good with the algorithm, bro. Get good with the algorithm, bro. Post, have a consistent schedule, have a consistent topic or consistent thing that you do. Like me, I talk about motivational stuff. I post vlogs and I do mukbangs, bro. Anything else y'all wanna see, let me know in the comment section and I post my music. Music is coming, bro. Music is on the way, bro. Be ready for that. Like, stay consistent, bro. I don't know how many times I have to say that. Stay consistent as possible, bro. Um, What else I gotta say, bro? Um, I forgot what I was talking about. I'm not going to hold you. Uh, oh, yeah, that's what I was saying. Have a set schedule, bro. Have a set schedule. Come home. Do what you got to do. Wake up. Post on TikTok. Before you go to sleep, post on TikTok. I post YouTube videos every other day at 5 to 6 o'clock, bro. Every single other day. You got to stay consistent, bro, because the algorithm will see that. When you have good topics, good thumbnails, don't half-ass nothing, bro. Don't half-ass nothing. And I know this video is all over the place. But if you serious, you should be writing down notes. Dead ass. You should be writing down notes as I'm talking. You should be writing this shit down, bro. I screen recording this shit. Like, dead ass. 
I shouldn't, you shouldn't, it shouldn't have to be in order. It shouldn't have to be in order for you to get what I'm saying. Like, y'all not dumb. Y'all not dumb. If y'all want y'all life to be good, this shit shouldn't even be new what I'm saying to you. But I'm just saying it because some people need to hear it. So that's why I'm saying it to you. Um, what else I gotta say? Stop. Okay, this is what this is what's about to help me for the next six to eight months of my life. S S S. Stop, sell, and save. Stop bad habits. You already know your bad habits. I don't even need to get on that, bro. Stop scrolling on Instagram for three for three hours. Stop scrolling on TikTok for three hours. Stop wasting time talking to people that's wasting your time. Okay. Stop worrying about what other people are thinking. Stop worrying about how other people are feeling because none of that shit matters. Nobody has the same vision that you have. So why are you worried about what they care? If they don't, if they're not on the same wave or not on the same stuff that you're trying to promote and you're trying to do, bro, fuck them, bro. Like, it don't matter, bro. Niggas is gonna hate. Niggas is gonna be jealous. Niggas is gonna be envious, bro. It don't matter. If they not on your wave, it don't matter. Fuck them. Do what you gotta do. Niggas is gonna say what they wanna say. They gonna feel how they wanna feel. But when that money start coming in, they not gonna be saying nothing. It's always funny till you get the money. Facts. It's always funny till you get the money, bro. That's facts. Secondly, bro, stop sale. Find something to sell, bro. Find a product to sell. Find something to sell, bro. If you're already selling something, sell something else to the people that you're already selling to. That's how you make more money, bro. Andrew Tate said that, bro. Real talk. Sell something to the people that you're already selling shit to, bro. If you're selling shit to them, they're going to buy. They're going to bring more people. Even if they're not buying the first product, they're buying the second product. If they're not buying the second product, they're buying the first product. Simple, bro. This shit is all off the head, bro. If y'all ain't subscribed yet, I'm on your ass. Blue face style. Right? Number three, save. You need to be saving. Saving is one of the, saving is probably the most important thing out of everything because if you don't have money that you're saving to use to invest into other stuff, you're not going to get anywhere. You're going to be stuck in the same spot. That's what me, that's what I was in. I was stuck in the same spot. But now I'm about to change all that shit, bro. I'm about to get my diet right. I'm about to start eating out, bro. I'm about to be saving, bro. I was spending like $900 a month eating out, bro. That's not cool, bro. <laughs> That's not cool. But you got to check yourself. I check myself. You got to check yourself. You got to figure out what you what you wasting your money on, bro. Real talk. So save your money, bro. You got to save your money. You have to have money to invest. Have money to invest into other things, bro. Have money to invest into other things. I don't know what you want to do in life, bro. I don't know what you want to do. But whatever you want to do, bro, have money to invest into that shit, bro. You know what I'm saying? Get rich before you get legal, bro. I don't care how you got to make your money. Just make your money because nobody likes you being broke. Move smart. Move smart. Stay on point. Stay intact. Stay on tap. Stay tight, bro. Because not everybody wants to see you win, bro. Stay tight as possible, bro. You got to be tactical in these streets. In your job, you don't even gotta be in the streets, bro. You could be at work. You could have a coworker that's hating, plotting to get you fired, bro. Stay on point. Don't ever, bro. Listen to what they say, and watch what they do, bro. Listen to what they say and watch what they do. Watch how a nigga moving, bro. He moving weird. Mm, I gotta step back. Watch what they say. Watch him. You just, I, bro. I watched everybody, bro. I know what you about to say before you even say it, bro. I know how you feeling. I know what you about to say. I, I know it because I watch. I pay attention to people. I know body language. I can read shit really well because I watch people. Watch people very, very closely, bro. Um, What else can I say to y'all, bro? Because I ain't going to lie to you, bro. This is the key to getting rich right here, bro. I'm about to be on this shit for eight months straight, bro. I'm telling you, y'all about to see crazy come up. No cap. Um, what else? Yeah, let go of dead weight, bro. Let go of dead weight, bro. I don't I don't really know how to explain this, but let go of dead weight. If people are not serving you no justice, if people are holding you back, if people are slowing you down, and they don't really want to see you win, but they act like they want to see you win, let go of that shit. Or don't pay any attention to it. Don't pay any attention. Zero attention. Let that shit go, bro. Because these people are... 
at a very, very low vibration, and they are getting body snatched by other, other shit, bruh. I'm not gonna go super deep into that because I'm not a spiritual channel. If y'all wanna watch a spiritual channel, go watch Eric Flo, bro. I watch him every single day, bro. Cool dude. But I'm not really deep on, a, I'm not really, it's not a spiritual channel. But people are so low, people's vibrations are so low that they allow shit to control them and control how they feel, like envy, jealousy, hate. That shit takes control of them and they don't even know why they're saying the stuff that they're saying or acting the way they're acting towards you because it's it's controlling, it's envious, it's jealousy. You don't even know this shit, but they don't even know why they're doing it. So it's like, either you let go of it completely or you don't pay any attention to it at all, bro. Because like I said, at the end of the day, bro, you only know what's best for you, bro. Don't nobody else know what's good for you except for you, bro. Remember that shit, bro. You only know what's good for you, bro. Nobody else knows what's good for you. Like, I see life like this. I always say this to all my clients, bro, because I cut hair. I say this to every single one of my clients, bro. Life, I see life, I see goals like this. Life is, life goes like a prescription, bro. It's like prescription glasses. If I put on my prescription glasses and a nigga try to put on their prescription glasses, they not going to see what I see. They going to be seeing blurry mushrooms and stuff all over the place. Like they going to be seeing crazy. And I put on my glasses, I'm seeing focus, I'm locked in, I'm in tunnel vision, bro. I'm, I'm on it. So focus on what you're trying to do. Don't expect your family to see it. Don't expect your friends to see it. Don't expect your girl to see it. Don't expect nobody to see it. Your mammy, your poppy, don't expect nobody to see it, bro. You you the only one that, that's supposed to see what you got going on. All the millionaires, bro. DDG, the Shade Frost, Cassinette, bro. Everybody was making fun of them niggas until they rich. Nobody's laughing now. Everybody's on their dick. So do what you supposed to do, bro. Fuck with them, bro. Don't worry about what they doing, bro. Niggas can laugh all they want to laugh, but stay focused on what is important to you. Remember, remember and this is the last thing I'm going to say for the video, bro, because I don't even know how long we're doing this. Remember why you're doing it. Remember why you're doing it, bro. I'm doing it for financial freedom, freedom to spend time by myself, freedom for my family, freedom for my friends, freedom for everybody, bro. I'm trying to, I'm trying to have freedom in general, bro. I'm trying to have freedom. I'm not trying to be waking up like, oh, do I have enough of rent? Oh, like, no, bro. I'm trying to be waking up like I'm straight. I know that's how you trying to be waking up. You trying to be waking up like that. You know what I'm saying? So get to that shit, bro. Stop bullshitting. Like, I know y'all probably just watched the party vlog and y'all like, man, I was lit. I'm lit. But now I'm, I'm on real shit. This is how I look on a daily basis, bro. I don't be trying to look sweet on a daily basis, bro. I'm focused. I don't care what nobody thinks. Because when I'm whipping that motherfucking track hawk and I dance, they're going to be like, damn, this thing is having. So it's like, stay focused on yourself, bro. Stay focused on the goal, you know? So I know this video was all over the place, but I just had to, like, come on here and just really speak my mind and just let y'all know, like, why you suck at life. Why you're failing at life over and over and over again. That's why you're failing. You have no discipline. You have no structure. You quit too easy. You quit too fast, bruh. Keep going, bruh, and stop caring what everybody think. As I get older, I'm, I stop caring what everybody think. I don't really care what nobody be saying no more. That shit is like mute to me. That shit going one ear right out the other, bruh. I know sometimes people mean best for me. They don't, they don't mean no harm. But at the end of the day, that shit can be harmful because... As a young man or as a young woman, bro, trying to get it out here in the world, you gotta understand that mental is very important. Mental is also one of the most important things about your mental health, especially when you're an entrepreneur or you're trying to get it on your own. If somebody say something and it mess up your whole day, you're thrown off completely. That means your whole day is thrown off. Me, personally, if my day starts off bad, which I don't, none of my days really start off bad anymore. I try to stay as positive as, as, positive as I can be. But if my day starts off bad, people people notice that. Especially if they see you on a regular basis, they notice that something is wrong with you. And now you're not at your full peak. So because you don't feel good one day, oh, I don't feel good today, I'm gonna stay in the house. But you could have ran into Jay-Z, that nigga could have gave you a record deal on the spot. Like, you know what I'm saying? So you never know what can happen. So always try to stay at a high vibration. My, my leg is vibrating, I don't know why my leg is vibrating. But try to stay at a high vibration and, and try to 
you know, just, I don't even know, bro. I don't even know. I'm not going to lie to y'all, but all that shit just came off the head, bro. I just feel like saying that to y'all because I feel like a lot of people need to hear that. Um, so, yeah, bro, if you like the video, hit the like button, subscribe, and share. Like I said, I could talk about this shit all day, bro. Once I, start, once I get a 1,000 subscribers, maybe even 2,000, I'm going to start going live and just chopping it up with y'all, just really talking. And just, like, whatever questions y'all got, bro, I just answer them, like, straight on the spot because that's just what I do, bro. So, if y'all like the video, hit the like button, subscribe, and share. And we out. Ta-da.